The thing that drew me to Back on My Feet is um, that I have a, a big interest in helping people who find themselves in difficult situations. So my name is Jeannie and I work with Back on My Feet um, and I primarily support uh, the members through their recovery process um, as well as um, supporting them in finding employment. This organization is very much about community, so providing community for these folks in the morning runs, um, in the workshops, um, in some of the other activities that we do, and it expands from members to alumni. So you don't stop getting the benefit of what Back on My Feet has to offer uh, once you graduate. Going to the alumni events is amazing because you see, you get to hear from people, oh, I'm doing really well in this job, I just got promoted, and they're so excited um, about what they've been able to achieve. Jeannie is involved with Back on My Feet in virtually every capacity possible. She comes to our morning walks and runs, which are geared towards building community and positive interactions. She works as a career coach, which means she works one-on-one -on -one with a member to help them prepare for employment, write a resume, um, do job applications. And then she also leads group educational workshops where she'll come in and talk about interpersonal skills and professional skills that can help our members be successful as they move through each stage of their plan and their goals. My name is Hannah and I nominated Jeannie for this award for the amazing work she does with our members who are experiencing homelessness and are in addiction recovery. Um, I live pretty close to um, some of the facilities, so I've been able to run or walk uh, to engage in some of my activities, but where things are farther away or the weather is really cold um, and I need multiple things in my car. I need changes of clothes, I need masks, I need Kleenex for, you know, people nose run in, in, in the, in the wintertime. So without my car, uh, that would be impossible. So I've relied on it quite a bit um, for all the things that I do. Um, one of the first ones that comes to mind is a workshop uh, that I did with a group at um, Pathway to Recovery. And uh, typically this is a group that can be pretty quiet and it can be a challenge to get them engaged. And uh, I'm also uh, the kind of person that tends to um, prepare a lot. This time, I put my notes down, just let it all come from the heart. And the way they responded was kind of amazing. I think every person said something. They were bantering back and forth with each other. And it was, I sat in my car afterwards and I just went, oh my gosh, that was amazing. Jeannie is a really special volunteer. Every one of our members that she works with, she is so genuine and she makes them feel heard, listened to, cared about. And that authenticity really speaks to our members and makes them engage and be eager to work hard and improve their situation.